Okay, this is on remainder factor theorem. We are given that x squared minus 1 is a factor of this. Factor means when I take this whole expression, then I divide it by this whole thing, the remainder is 0. So that's what it means by factor. Okay, now you should notice that this quadratic expression here can be factorized into x plus 1 x minus 1 okay which means that if this is a factor of this then individually when you factorize this each of this should also be a factor of this all right now once you know that you can easily show this and this okay uh, Okay, so this is how you do the question. Because this is a factor, right? Okay, so individually, uh, x plus 1 is a factor. x minus 1 also is a factor. So if I were to let x be, that means when you let this be equal to 0, uh, x equals to 1. So this will give me one equation and this will give me another equation okay now let me show you the detail working you sub minus one inside here replace all the x with minus one and remember when you do that please put your brackets Okay, that will give you, uh, this is minus 3, you can press calculator, uh, minus 3, so it is, uh, then this will give me 7, 8, okay, so when you simplify, you will get this, alright? Okay, then uh, for uh, okay, this is for f minus 1 equals 0, right? Okay, so when you have f1 equals 0, uh, f1 equals 0, you sub in. Okay, then you will get this other equation and then when you solve it right after you solve simultaneously you will get these two answers all right so that's how you do this kind of question uh, the next one is part two uh, they say hence solve this one this one is exactly the same as this that you have here this whole expression here right it's the same so when they say hence you must use the result from part a okay then you just sub in a here and you can solve them as seen here okay so i'm showing you two methods to solve this question uh, when i put in 7 over 4 and when i put in b as it minus 11 over 4 right i'll get this now because this is an equation uh, which they ask you to solve so there's an equal zero on the right here okay it means that i can multiply every term by four to get rid of the denominator because this okay because this uh
fraction here is going to give you problem when you try to factorize uh. so i remove this and i can remove this because this is an equation if this is not an equation i cannot multiply everything by four okay so please take note uh. now from the earlier part you are told that x square minus one is a factor so i know that this times something should give me back this and the only way to get x power 4 is for x squared to multiply by 7x squared. So these two will give me the greatest power. And number times number has to give me this number minus 11. That's why this has to be plus 11. Okay, so this is what we call the inspection method. And in order to find the unknown p, uh, you see, it's actually... Oops. It's actually it's actually a uh, seven x power four. Okay, so this is power two, power one, power zero. All right. So you know that this has to be a quadratic equation. So I have to compare coefficient of x. Why x? Huh? Because the only way to get um, this, uh, you see, if I multiply by this to here, I'll get minus p, right? Okay, minus p, and that'll be minus px. On this side here, the x is minus 28. That's why my p is 28. Okay, then I sub in here and uh, I solve it like an equation. So x equals to the three answers are uh, x equals to minus 1 or x equals to 1 or x equals to this and this. Sorry, four answers. All right, so this is how you solve this question using inspection method. Now you can also use what we call the long division method, okay? This step here is the same as what I've done here. That means I multiply throughout by 4 to get rid of the denominator. I can only do that because this is an equation. Huh? If this is not an equation, that means if it's just like that, right, without the equal sign, huh? which is what we call an uh, expression, then you cannot multiply throughout by 4, okay? You can only do this if this is an equation, which is the case here. Okay, then you do your long division. Remember how to do long division. Uh, take this, divided by this, that will give you this, correct? Okay, so you do, 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 and remember to put your minus and your brackets okay minus and your brackets minus and your brackets all right okay then you will get this and then you solve as per what i've done on the right here okay